And these are warm-up throws in the shot put. You'll have seen the wheelchairs getting into place for the next final on the track, which is the women's 800 T54. A little bit of the spotlight now on Thierry Sibon. Well, he'll go in a couple of minutes' time. Only two competitors thus far that have gone in the shot put F34 final. Still warming up there. He's got a personal best of 12.86, which is an unratified mark. 9.93, a season best. Well, he certainly gave that some, didn't he? That is well out there. The man he's got to beat, it's got the world record, 11.46 is a world record. So Sibone here, he likes it, 9.38. Hasn't reached his season best, which I mentioned a moment or two ago, which is 9.93. It does they move him into second position ahead of Luis Gervais Baja no! of Cameroon. Well, that's very, very similar to his last effort. You can't say he holds anything back, can you? A big roar he lets out as he lets it go. And next up after this man, it will be the former world record holder from Qatar. Abdul Rahman. Abdul Qadir, Abdul Rahman, he'll be going. But I can tell you now, without even needing to measure that one, it is not as far as 9.61. So 9.61 puts Thierry Sabon into second place in the men's shot put F34 final. <laughs> Abdullah Haia of the UAE. His second attempt, his first, 8.66. Eight ninety nine is season best for the man from the UAE. Well, nine thirty two. That is a new personal best, surpassing nine point one two. His previous personal best that takes him into the bronze medal position. The last of three throws now. All the athletes as we keep on reiterating. Take three in a row from that seated position. Well, that one there, he's quite happy. It looks like he's taken a foul. On that third one. So his best mark there of 9.32 will stand. And keep him in third position behind Thierry Sabon of France and Siamak Salah Farage Dazar of Iran. So back to the men's shot put, F34 final, and the outgoing world record holder with his 10.68. Abdul Rahman Abdul Gadir Abdul Rahman. His world record having 10.68, but surpassed tonight three times by Siamak Sela for a Seda of Iran. 11.46. World record mark now, and that's beyond nine meters, and it might have hit 10. 9.32 at the moment for bronze for the United Arab Emirates and Abdullah Hayayi. Abdul Rahman, it's a 
actually set the world record here last month. That's just shy of nine meters. Okay, okay, okay. So Abdul Rahman. Practice throws haven't been bad. Here's his first attempt. That's a brilliant attempt now. That line is the world record line. And it's not very far away from it. 1068. His world record from earlier. 1046, putting him in second place. Obviously, the world record line is heading into the competition. They don't move it if they have a world record during the competition. But at least he knows the line that he has to aim for and surpass in order to have a chance for the gold. So Abdul Rahman in position, waiting again. Throw number two. He's up into second place already. That's just slightly shorter. Ten meters seventeen. <laughs> So, third and final attempt for Abdul Rahman. Let's see if he can get it beyond the old world record line and give himself a chance of gold here. Oh, he's got it beyond! No, that's beyond his old world record. So we have a chance of a Qatari medal now. Exquisite throw. It's ten meters. It needs to be below, beyond 11 meters, and I don't think it is. Was very close, beyond that goal line. Brilliant throw, the throw of his life. Beyond his old world record. It's 10 meters 80. Abdul Rakhba is in second place. In the 5,000 meters T11. Let's move across, shall we? Men's shot put F34, and this is Wang of China. Now, while we're watching this, I've just been handed a piece of paper. The revised results of the men's 400 T11. It was the first race of the night. You might remember that the original winner, Gomez, disqualified for going out of the lane. The gold then going to Silva, Daniel Silva of Brazil, and he was disqualified. Mauricio Valencia of Colombia. It's his third round attempt, having achieved 10 metres 20 in the first round. He's lying in fifth place at the moment. And that, another solid try. World record was 10.68 going into today, and he's gone beyond that. So the leading four have all exceeded the world record. Valencia outside the medals, he's fourth, 10.73. F thirty four men shot put final. And for a Zeta, eleven fifty two. Let's have a look at Abdul Rahman in the shot put in the middle. Former world record holder, he's actually gone past his old mark, but is lying in third place. 1068 was his former mark. Three throws at a time. 1072, 1069, 1073, 1080 is best. He beat his old world record mark four times, but he's still in third. 
And that man, Maurizio Valencia. Woo! He likes it. Woo! He likes it a lot. Big smiles from the Colombian, Maurizio Valencia, on course for bronze. 10.93, a new best mark. He's in the bronze medal position. That is a season best throw from Maurizio Valencia of Colombia. So confirmation of the shot put F34 category, a world record for Iran, Siamak Salah Farajda. 11.52, his compatriot Mosan Kaidi, 11.12 in second place and Maurizio Valencia with a season best 10.93 taking out the gold medal unfortunately for Qatar Abdul Rahman Abdul Qadir Abdul Rahman finishing in fourth position so missing out on picking up a medal at his home games but he did throw a season best 10.80 in that competition